Welcome to the Dad Lifetime blog. This is your host, Chris. I'm gonna show you how to do, or put together a baby Brezza machine. I just went through cleaning this for my kid. Um, let's talk about the machine real quick. This is basically a baby cure egg. You have your different buttons up here, powder setting, water only, temp, ounces, start, power. So this machine also has a water tank in the back. It'll look like that. it will sit in right back here. I'll show you how to put that in just a second. When you get the baby Brezza, you get all of these different little parts here. So, as you'll notice in all my videos, we're gonna call this a one beer job. So we got one beer back here. Let's show you how you put this thing together. The first thing you need to do, you have a little plastic piece. It goes up right here. Now, if you try to do this outside of up here, you're gonna have trouble getting it in and set later on. So you wanna make sure you do that. Then you place, the base in there. You're gonna be able to read the max and min and refill on this side. You'll see that it fit there in the middle. So now we get to our next piece. It's going to be the orange one here. This slides in. So it's got like the wheel, wheel of bad games, whatever you want to call it. So then we're gonna pick up this piece. My little thing that has the slidey on the bottom. Really important part here is there's a little flap down here. It needs to go under that, otherwise it won't pour the formula correctly. So when you put this in, you can't put it on top. You need to get that front part in first, then set it down. Your next part, the rakes. So you're gonna push this down in here. You're gonna hear it go pop. So now we're all set. So we'll put formula in here next, which, let me get that out right here. I recommend using kind of like a, uh, rubber spatula. I'm not going to fill all the way up in this video, but I'm just showing you what you do here. My kid uses Simlac, so um, that's what we have. You would fill it all the way up to the top. Once you have that done, you'd stick this piece on the lid, then it clicks into place. So you have the top portion of this set and done. Now comes the part that you're going to be very familiar with with all your cleaning, the funnel and the top of the base. So if you see, you have the little uh, peg there. It goes in just like this. Okay, so you got one piece. This thing is removed. It's gotta be cleaned every four uses. It slides up in here and it clicks. There's also a drip guard. My wife has lost it for the time being, so that's what'll go there. Your water is your next portion. The water goes straight into the back here. You'll hear it go click, it sits in, click. Now you're all said and done. So you can see there's a little less than a one beer job, but since you're done, you might as well celebrate, have a beer and enjoy it. So make sure to fill up your uh, formula to the top there. Um, I like to clean this thing about every week to two. Um, it gets really gummy, this part right here especially. You have to clean it every four uses. So you get used to cleaning this piece a lot. I use the baby brush in it. But um, other than that, cleaning the baby Brezza is super easy and it is still one of the best investments that we've made since we've been formula feeding the kid.